what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be here with you guys today because this troll base right here is ridiculous, guys. Let's look at the let's look at the log on this thing, alright? So we're gonna go in here to our defense log, alright? And we're gonna go all the way down here to when I built the base. So you can see 16 hours I built the base and this was the first attack. Now, yes, people are getting a lot of dark elixir. <laughs> But you'll see why. It was on the outside, and I moved it since then. And then the last three attacks, and I'm getting attacked by max troops here. You can see there's a lot of max uh, barbarians, archers, there's some max hogs, um, some more barbarians, archers, more max hogs, all this kind of stuff. But guys, I woke up to all of this. It's like a hundred and, let's see, 30, 46, uh, 50... I don't want to add all that up. It's going to take me too long. But I think it's like 100 and 100 and something trophies. So it's kind of like a maze base, as you can see. I made a maze base for Town Hall 8 a long time ago, probably like a year ago. There was something like this. It wasn't as trolly. But this is just ridiculous. So what we're going to do is we're going to go and watch some of these replays. I haven't seen this most recent one, so let's see what goes on here. Uh, Mr. MVP Yixian. Y Yixian? Yixian. Yixian is coming in. He probably thinks that the majority of the loot is in the mines and pumps, but it's not. That's right. It is in the storages. I mean, look at the gold. You can tell that the, that all the gold is in the storages and not up there at the top of the base. So he's coming in. I don't think anybody yet has gone through the actual maze por portion of the base, but with the way that he's attacking this, it actually looks like he's trying to get... Um, 50% because you don't fully deploy like that unless you're trying to get 50% or take out a lot of stuff, whatever. Um, so he's not getting that much loot. Look, he's only gotten 4,000 loot so far on this base. The walls and everything are just ridiculous. I made this super quick. I was just like, all right, I want a maze that has two entrances and I want to see if someone can get to the town hall. Nobody's even gotten a star yet. And all that I was trying to protect was from the two star with the town hall. So he's coming in with these archers right here, so he probably gets a little bit of gold right there. Nope, that mortar is taking him out. Only one of them was shooting the... Oh, there they go, get out. Oh, yes, he got it. <laughs> so guys, he's only gotten 10,000 of each resource on this troll maze base. You can see that both sides of it are a little bit different. We've got our heroes on either side. I think they were both dead at this point because they died in a previous attack. Um, but we can just fast forward it because he's almost out of time and he's not going to get anything else. So 10,000 and 11,000. I have 4,000 gold left over. 2,200 dark elixir left over. Ah, Mr. MVP, I'm so sorry that that had to happen to you. Um, let's go ahead and go down. Let's see, that guy got 37%. Uh, he didn't get that much loot. Let's see how this guy did. So this guy got a lot of loot from me. He probably attacked from this bottom portion over here, if I had to guess. Yeah, so he's going to attack from the bottom right here. Um, there goes a wall breaker, which sucks because that's going to let everyone get in there, and I don't have any splash damage right there. I do have uh, mortars, but they don't reach that area, I guess. I thought that the mortars would cover it. There they go. So the mortars are coming in. The Inferno Towers are right there. Honestly, I should probably scoot the Inferno Towers closer to the edge because nobody's coming through the maze part of the actual base. Um, so he's just coming in for the gold. He's coming for what he wants, and he's going to get it. Uh, he hasn't gotten any elixir yet or any dark elixir, which is hilarious. Still no elixir or dark elixir, just going after the gold. Uh, the Expos are owning him right now as he's trying to uh, get further into the base. He sees that dark elixir right there and he wants it. I had to switch it up because my dark elixir was where those gold storages were. Um, and people were stealing it. I had to get rid of it. But look guys, he's gotten exactly 200,000 gold, which is hilarious that he got. He's gotten exactly 200,000. So... Now he's coming in for the rest of it. Uh, he's got a couple more wall breakers. He's got four max heal spells. All of his troops are maxed out. So he's going to drop in again right there and see what he can do. This is one <coughs> of the only guys recently uh, that's been able to do fairly well against the base. So 16,000 elixir. Still going after the gold and the elixir. We've got a mortar over here that's helping out a little bit. Those barbarians are about to take out that archer tower right there. And uh, they got 20,000 of the elixir. But they didn't get much else. I mean, besides, obviously, the goal that they were able to get from that bottom portion because uh, I exposed it a lot. I should probably move some of the gold around. Here he comes, dropping off that heal spell. Bro, that heal spell is not going to be worth it. He used two heal spells in that one spot, 
and only got 70,000 um, elixir. So it's not worth it. He, did, he, he barely made anything. Uh, <laughs> and he, he, there he goes. He's getting some of the gold, but the mortar and the expo are, are absolutely crushing him. So 251,000 gold. That's not a bad raid, um, but it's still funny to see because people are probably like, Mo, what the heck is this base that you've made? So he didn't get any dark elixir. We were able to protect that. Now we'll go back to the beginning um, and I'll show you guys the first... Oh, I can't show you guys the first couple attacks. Dang it. Now this guy owns us. Uh, four hog riders, a golem, a max golem, and this was when I was dumb enough to have my uh, elixir out there. Which one did we just watch? We just watched that one with the wizards. Uh, let's watch... Oh, I can't watch it! Dang it! Alright, so we're gonna watch this one then. Uh, with the king and the queen coming in. See, oh wow. So he actually got into the dark elixir. Let's see how this happens. So he's got a lot of giants. He's got so many giants. And he's got a heal, uh, a healer right there. Oh, he's totally in range of my air defense. Come on, don't give me that. There you go, air defense. Shoot it down. There you go. All right, so air defense is going to take that healer down uh, real quick. We've got a lot of expos over here on these giants, but they're still going to take out that air defense. That guy should have waited with his healer. If he dropped that healer off right now, dunzo, because my expos are pointing towards the ground. Here go the Inferno Towers. There's a rage spell in there, and they are the Inferno Towers are wrecking those giants, completely annihilating them. There goes the heal spell for him to come in and get the Dark Elixir. I don't know what I should do, guys. Maybe I should put the dark elixir right here where this uh, elixir storage is because I have freaking three archer towers over there. We're also going to move, we're definitely going to move our infernos down um, a little bit just because it seems like that's the area of the base that we are getting attacked. And then I will update you guys later. Oh gosh, I just shook everything. <laughs> Whoa! All right, so let's go ahead and do that real quick. Let's edit, uh, edit this layout and... Let's go ahead and take this and let's do eraser mode. We'll remove that, we'll remove this, and then we're gonna remove our infernos and remove our Teslas. And then we're gonna do dark elixir right there, elixir right here, and then infernos are both gonna be right here on the edge uh, with their range. So this inferno is gonna own anything that comes and tries to get that dark elixir. And you know what we're going to do? We're going to put both Teslas right over here as well so that they can protect that Dark Elixir. Anybody wants to come and take my Dark Elixir, you're going to get wrecked. So if you guys find my base, come at me. Come at me and see what you can do. I hope that you guys enjoyed this troll base. I think that it's pretty funny. I really want somebody to come in from the sides, though, and not like these corners. I don't want people to come in from the corner. I want people to please just come in through the maze. But that's going to be it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Really do appreciate it. As always, make sure you keep calm and to troll on, Pummer, right? See you guys later. Peace.